Yo, what's going on guys? It is Insanity here and welcome to today's video. And in today's video, we're going to be talking about the Globe Trotter rocket launcher within Borderlands 3. Now, if you guys do go ahead and enjoy or find this video informative, please leave a like as it also does help this channel grow. And also please subscribe if you are new. I do Borderlands content like this almost every single day, so please consider subscribing. I have a playlist on my channel called How to Borderlands for all your Borderlands needs and whatnot, and that link will be down in the description below. So moving on to the Globe Trotter, the Globe Trotter is a cov launcher that looks a lot like the yellow cake its special effect is when you fire this weapon it shoots a blade looking like projectile kind of like the boring gun that goes along the ground once it hits a solid object it begins bouncing up and down like a basketball dealing explosive damage obviously this is a nod to the harlem globetrotters which is a basketball team so makes pretty makes a lot of sense that it's bouncing like a basketball this launcher can also come in any element moving on on how you could get this weapon this weapon is obtainable from scourge the invincible on minos prime now scourge is the raid boss for the guardian takedown so this is gonna pr pretty take a little while take a little while i'm not gonna lie this does take a long time and does require luck to obviously get this weapon so you know just being for a long haul uh there are a few weapons that you could even get from it and i'm going to be covering those in the in later videos i actually have a video on how you could do the guardian takedown solo so if you guys want to go watch that guide you know that link will be down in the description moving on on my personal opinions about this weapon this weapon deals pretty good damage depending on how many projectiles you hit now this weapon did kill me a lot as well uh that's also because i was running around a lot and that's pretty understandable so yes this weapon can kill you and it does deal self damage i used it with my zane and i was dealing decent damage on enemies on mayhem 10 but to be fair i was also using an experimental build of a current build i'm working on so then i switched over to flak to see if it made a difference between amp damage and normal damage and yes it made a big difference and even like combining it with a one shot or shield is just insane now flak is more of a bossing type of character in this game but this weapon also allows him to mop pretty easily the only problem is your ammo but th th this could really wipe out an entire area of enemies in like no time at all i would recommend that you use it mobbing in instead of bossing but you can also use it in bossing as well so yeah that's pretty much it for today's video guys if you guys did enjoy your found it informative please leave a like as it also does help this channel grow and also subscribe if you are new i do borderlands content like this almost every single day and yeah it's been insanity and i'll see you all later